Hi, welcome to SBR Videos. I'm Peter Lojak. This is Mike Runner. This is the Ed, uh, College Basketball Odds Couple show for uh, April 1st. We only got one game on the cards. Won't be now. calling it that for long, buddy. This will yeah. all be over on Monday. And you know, uh, uh, Mike Brenner, a lot of times with these kinds of games, I'm like, I don't have a pick. Today, I'm going to have a you pick. You know what? And yesterday, you really? You got yeah. a pick for today. I, I, got, I got a pick on this shop. Got a pick on this game. And you know what? I promise, and you can say what you want, viewers, but we all know what's inside our guts at the end of the day. Yesterday, after I, I pulled that trigger on Valpo, something inside said that, man, you might be on the wrong side. But you know what? That's all what it's about. It's it's all, it's a roller coaster. And I've had days where I've gotten whooped three days in a row, but that shit doesn't last long. With that being said, Pistol Beat, because yeah. I want to win every game. You know I that. I mean, I think you just wanted to give a pick for the fans. Yeah, it's the not viewers, even that. No, you know what no, I mean? No, no. I, I got swallowed up in Bryce Drew uh, verbiage really? and, okay. and locker room info, and I just really I bought into it. Okay. And that got bit in the ass. I'm not going to back up off on it. I, I literally took another ass whooping. Oh, and two. Unacceptable. 66 and 54. Thank God. God. And you know what? Very I didn't nice. build that record up. I've given shitty picks all along. <laughs> That's so right. That's coming right. back, I feel something good today, and I'm excited about Final Four weekend. Pistol Pete laid off yesterday. Mm -hmm. Smart, smart. 42 and 56 and 43. I got a pick today though that I think is going to be. And what I got to tell you also, and you do it all the time, I have my own account that I play, and uh, I have absolutely been killing it on my own account. Oh, congratulations! I did really? very good in them. Yeah, yeah. I have like a little power pick thing. I've had over 158 picks on those for the year. This is all documented. Yeah. Yeah. I've, I've won a, well, month, listen, a lot of money. I'm 64% on them. You can make claims about winning on your private account because of what you've done publicly. I yeah. cannot do that. But, you know, <laughs> well, no, it and, is what and it again, is. And, and in the future, we're going to have some power picks uh, available for Major League Baseball. But, hey, it is what it is. I just hate losing. I hate losing. I take it personal. But you know what? It's all good, and it's nobody's fault. I'm not going to rant and rave and go off on Valpo today. It's my own fault. I take responsibility. But I got one pick tonight that really? I'm going to think is going to bring me right back. Yeah. All right. Well, we might be on the same side. We might be on different sides because I'm not taking the total here. I'm taking the side. I am taking uh, Moorhead State first half and full game plus four Jesus and a half God. and plus two and a half. Uh, Moorhead State, you know, these games have been relatively close. I mean, obviously this isn't a, a, a huge edge. If it was Moorhead State plus eight, I would think it was a pretty yeah. huge edge. And what, but, what some of our viewers might not know is this is a round robin tournament. So yeah. these teams play, they, they play each other. other. They can play each other three times in five days. And that's what's happening with this scenario. Yeah. And home court has already been very favorable to both teams. Now the issue here, right. The issue. Now, I've got to ask you this, though, yeah. because you lost a bet going against me. Right. That's why we're going to Hooters today right. at 2 o'clock Eastern, yeah. and you're paying that bet <laughs> yeah. off. And oh, we're yeah. going to do a live Periscope. We're bringing you in with us. We're proving it. Are you just putting this out there because you want revenge from that absolutely bet? Absolutely not. I okay. don't even know what side you're on, but uh, absolutely okay. not. I, uh, I I looked at this game. Uh, you know, Obviously, it's a third game, so they're familiar, they are familiar with each other. We know what the issues are. Rebounding roughly even Perfect. for this team. Yeah. And uh, Nevada is, is, is a... a better outside shooting team and if they you know nail it from if they you know come in and if they shoot 50% from 3 they're going to they're going to win and cover, cover here yeah. but That's uh, my sense to... is that uh, my sense okay. is that it's more likely that uh, the shooting should even out and that it's more like again it's only four and a half points so it's not a massive line my sense is the shooting evens out and that the edge here would be with uh, Morehead state I'll take them on the first half plus two and a half and full game plus four and a half okay. and on my private account I even bet them uh, on Ooh, the first see, half money yeah, line I'm at 145 I like that I like your confidence today Pete you well, were definitely back and bounced out of that, whatever you were going through, and that's good stuff. But we have another bet now. Now uh -oh. you have an opportunity <laughs> okay. to get back what you're going to lose today at Hooters, baby, because okay. I'm going to get my money's worth really? for real. I'm not kidding. You're I on Nevada. Wait. Tell us why. First half only. Okay. And Mine I got two. it too. Yes. I grabbed Split it line, two. two or two yeah. and a half. And again, I'm alluding to home court advantage in this particular series, all right, has really, really been favorable to the home home crowd, okay? I mean, the home team. So the crowd today knows they're that six-man early. Hey, bottom line, these are beer-drinking college kids. They can't wait to end it today. Right. And this team, even though Moorhead State's not going to quit, they don't have quit in them. They're going right. to show up. I just think that six-man, which is going to be the energy from that arena, is going to pay off in the first half because I, I got news for you. That crowd's going to be a little bit hammered at halftime as well. Yeah. So uh, Nevada, <laughs> first half minus two. I'm not kidding you, Pete. I like that. Okay. That's an official bet. We're going yeah. against each other. Going against each other. I got plus two and a half. But the game, you might have something on that because I think it's going to be tight. I don't see a blowout, even right. though Nevada pretty much ate their lunch last game. I mean, there's no question that I like the full game spread uh, more than the first half spread. Mm -hmm. And uh, for my bet, I if I, I didn't I actually didn't bet the uh, first half I, on the spread. I bet it at plus 145. I think that if, if Moorhead State, you know, comes to play in the first half, then they then they probably you win know, the first half. And my mind's half, already so. going to, you already won this bet, Brenner, so where's... No, 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 where, not I'm not, This is my mind, so where's the next spot we're going to have lunch? <laughs> yeah. That's where I just went for 30 <laughs> seconds. Excuse me, I'm back I, uh, now. 
I agree with you that uh, that for Moorhead State, I like the for, the full game spread more than the uh, than the than the first half spread. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Well, fantastic. I love it. How about that next game? Um, I'm talking about Saturday, baby, and don't forget oh, yeah. to tune in because we are doing the Odds Couple show. Um, we're going to be having that uh, live tomorrow. I mean, it'll be shot, but you will have access to it tomorrow. Pete and I will have both of our picks, and we may have a couple four. different picks in yeah, for the final four. And then Monday's the big night, and uh, Pistol Pete's doing dinner at my house. Huh? My wife's throwing <laughs> down a throwdown for Pistol Pete. And also, I want you to go to our Sports Fix page, please, viewers, and check out. we got some great handicappers coming aboard for Major League Baseball. For NHL playoffs, Pistol Pete and I are going to be doing the Odds Couple show because we both bank a lot of money on our own accounts during NHL playoffs. and uh, Usually, not well, always. Well, I, or I, yeah, some, not always. sometimes yeah. for me, not always. I've but had sometimes. a really good run in WNBA on my yeah. own personal account as well. But baseball, I love it, and there's some really good avenues of profit there. So don't forget to check that out. And also, Sunday is our first NBA Odds Couple show for Major League Baseball. We're going to be doing that live via satellite because I'm going to be out there at Nat's wedding, so it's going to be a good deal. That's right. We're, 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 we're going to be discussing NBA during uh, the Major League Baseball Odds Couple show. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. No, because you said you were there. We're NBA odds couple. Well, we're doing it all. That's the odds couple. Let's wrap this up. (laughs) Let's, uh, you want to go to the board again? I'm going to pan one more time again, Pete. And I didn't mean to ramble today, but I'm looking forward to this lunch. 66 and 54. I get a little out of focus when I lose two (laughs) days in a row. No, I'm not kidding. I didn't like it. I didn't sleep good last night. I hear you. 55% 55% pistol peak, 42 and 56 at 43%, but that number's moving up. So you do get up. used to it, Mike Brenner. Take it from me. You do no, get I'm used not. to it. No, I'm not. That, that I won't allow to happen because that's not in my uh, vocabulary, buddy. All but right. with that being said, I've had a good day. I'm looking forward to a great weekend. Final four, baby.